Hi guys! So, it's been a couple of days since I have posted a video. I am deep in the heart of finals. I have just one left to take tomorrow. So, my life has been just kind of boring because I've just had my head in the books. So, I figured it would be fun to record a little bit of a different kind of video. And today I'm going to do 20 random facts about me so that y'all can get to know me a little bit better. I needed a little fun in these dreary, hard days of studying, so I thought this would be fun to record for y'all. Let's get started. Number one, I absolutely love to travel, and I wish I had the opportunity to do it a little bit more often than I do. I have visited around 13 countries, but I've been to Australia three times, New Zealand twice, and I've been to Spain and Portugal and Switzerland, Holland. And those are the ones I can think of off the top of my head. Number two, I absolutely love animals. I'm actually getting a degree in animal science from my university. But currently we have five dogs, we have four cats, six chickens, and a lizard. But growing up, I had just about every animal possible from guinea pigs to hamsters to mice to hatching chickens in my bedroom to frogs that I found on the street to turtles I found in ponds. I had just about every animal possible. Oh, and some bunnies who were outside bunnies and then learned to use our cat door. So I absolutely love animals. I'd have a lot more pets if I could, but being in college, unfortunately, I don't have the chance to. Number three, I have actually lived in Australia for five months. During the fall of 2015, I participated in a study abroad program at the University of Queensland in Brisbane, Australia. But I actually attended a smaller campus about an hour and a half from the city in Gatton, Australia, and it was a little agriculture campus. Number four, I have a small obsession with hats. Point A, these are all hats. Point B, let's just, let's show you. I like hats. Number five, I was a competitive gymnast and dancer for 15 years of my life. So doing dance, I danced competitively. I did jazz, tap, ballet, acro. I did a multitude of things. And then I did gymnastics for 15 years where I competed up to level eight, which training level nine. When I decided to back off from that, I was on the performance gymnastics team we represented the U.S. in Switzerland at the World Gymnastrata event, and that was a pretty incredible experience, to say the least. Number six, I am terrified of the dark. I don't like to be in the dark, like ever at all. And like just putting me in a place where it's really dark, I make up these scary stories in my head. So don't like the dark. Number seven, I am actually a fifth year college student. So my degree is taking me a little longer than I had hoped, but I did study abroad for a semester. I did a competitive meat judging team for a year and a half, which also set me back because we were traveling about a month of each semester. So I had to very much limit my classes. I honestly have no idea what I want to do with my life. I came to school originally pursuing vet school, but since decided that I don't like little Fluffy or Fido broken or bleeding or sad, I can't do it. I can't. Although it may not seem like it on camera, I am actually really shy. And it's something that I have been working super hard to kind of overcome because I need to be more out there and so it's something Kat's been working on real hard. In high school, I showed livestock. So I competitively showed lambs, goats, pigs, and cattle. 
and was also the president of my FFA chapter. So, I loved animals as you can tell and showed them. Also ate some of my animals and that might hit a bad note for some of y'all. But they're meat animals. So, I was raising them for food. But they were treated like queens and kings. Those things ate $50 a bag feed. They ate real well. They tasted really good too. I have had two different horses in my life and sadly I had to sell my last horse whenever I was coming to college. I've had Jackson and Nugget. One was a Missouri Fox Trotter and one was a thoroughbred off the track who taught me how to stay on and not kill myself because he was crazy. I miss riding more than absolutely anything and I do I do just about anything to be able to ride consistently again hoping that I could take some lessons or maybe one day have my own horse once again. Number 11, my best friend lives 500 miles away from me in Pensacola, Florida. So it's super sad. I only get to see her a couple of times a year. So I'm always so excited when I get to make the trip over to see her. Number 12, I have one brother who is 19 year, or he's about to turn 19 years old. I can't believe it. He also is special needs. He has autism. And so that has always been something growing up is we participated in a lot of Special Olympics event and growing up having therapists in the house 40 hours a week was always a different experience that a lot of other kids <laughs> didn't have So it's always been an interesting experience growing up with Michael number 13 I would absolutely love to have the chance to you know be a model or do modeling but at five foot one inches I'm not the ideal candidate, unfortunately. <laughs> Number 14, I absolutely love to learn. I am always learning, always pushing myself to learn more. Unfortunately, it's usually health and fitness related, not organic chemistry that I should be studying. Number 15, I have an irrational fear of cotton balls. I cannot stand that little squeaky feeling when you touch them. It just gives me the heebie-jeebies. Like the other day, I bought some new vitamins and they had a cotton ball in them. And I almost threw out the whole thing. Then I remembered that there's tweezers. And it still kind of freaked me out because I could just imagine myself touching them. I don't like them at all. Number 16, my beloved beau he turns four January 25th, and he is a Cocker Spaniel. He's literally the best dog I have ever had, and I love him like a child. It's kind of sad. Number 17, I have not seen a lot of like iconic movies, like the Titanic and Star Wars and literally anything. I have probably not seen it. I have such a freaking short attention span and sitting myself in front of the TV for an hour and a half, I can't do it because I sit there and I'm like, I could totally be doing something more productive with my time than sitting here. I don't know. I'm weird. Okay. Number 18. When I was four years old, we drove our car into floodwaters into our neighborhood and the water was incredibly deep. There's actually a kind man who stopped and rescued me from my mom's car. I ended up becoming great friends with his daughter, fun fact. But to this day, I'm still deathly afraid of rain and thunderstorms. And I think it has to stem from that traumatic experience. Number 19, I absolutely love plays. Some of my favorites are Wicked. I've seen it three times. And The Lion King, I've seen it twice. They're just some incredible performances and I love going to see them. Number 20, I absolutely love to shoot. And I 
am very much surprised at myself that I have not gotten my concealed carry license yet. I would like to carry because people are crazy and I am on the road so much by myself that being able to carry would just make me feel safer if I ever were to break down on the side of the road. On that note, I hope that you enjoyed learning 20 random facts about me. Give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it, and I will see y'all again soon with some of my normal videos. Just one final to go, and I'll have a month break to make some cool videos for y'all. Thanks for watching, guys. Bye!